Oh, so that's... That's why it's the Gates of Madness. Okay. Stay away from me. You've already spent too much time over there. And he says that after you complete the first quest and or spend a few days in there, which we've definitely completed the first quest. Anyways, back to the episode's point. Hey there, everybody, and welcome back to more Elder Scrolls for Oblivion and in this part. Ha! Hey, aren't you the lady from Passwall? No, you aren't. Hello. You dress the same. Very nice. I like that fashion. We are going over to one of the settlements here. Yay. No, it actually uh -oh. is a pretty decent settlement though. And I've created a special spell. F okay. I've created a special spell for it. Anyways, here's the entrance to Bliss. I thought she was squirting water out of her boobs very briefly. Just, it lined up poorly, all right? <laughs> uh, oh, very nice. Red kelp gas bladder? Well, there's a reason this place is a little crazy. All right. We are going to do a very specific quest today. And it's going to take me a while to complete it. This is the first quest I'm doing. I, I'm doing it like this because I knew it would take me a while to knock it out. Most people would wait until they've been here for a while, but no, no. I feel like this would hold me back. I must show my full potential to mess up within the first five episodes of this DLC. Now, we are going to High Cross, and that's all the way up there, I think. So we're going to be running for a little bit. But uh, this is brand new scenery, something we've never seen before in this game as well. I think it's all very pretty. Interesting. Why is this here? We're also going to be, of course, discovering everything we can along the way. It just makes sense. I don't know why I'm jumping. I don't need to increase my acrobatics anymore. It just makes sense for me to run. Let's go over here. And... Scamp. Scamp. The uh, hunger. Hungers are much scarier than scamps. Since we haven't been hit by one, I'll just tell you guys what they do. Oh, jeez. Well, we almost found out. They use their tongue to suck the life out of you. Oh, we got a hunger tongue. Very nice. Those are pretty rare. You found Fane. It's my Fane. Let's get this boat. What's the matter? Is it tired? Do you not have enough magic, ma'am? There we go. Steel arrow, strong potion of healing. I'm just going to go ahead and take that one out too. Ah, this angle's good. What's the name? Heretic War Priest. Find nothing of use. That's fine. Steel arrows, strong potions. Those are very nice. The heretics aren't, but those are. An Aster Bloom. It's a very nice view, but it's extraordinarily concerning to me that they have such a good scenic overlook of the city and they're called heretics. 
I don't know. There, there's not much good that comes of heretics in, in games like this. Right, right. Already harvested from her. Harvested? Ah, just a glass of Warx. Let's get back on the main path, and we're going to keep traveling upwards to High Cross. Yay. These legs were made for walking, and that's just what they'll do. They won't stop walking. They'll never stop walking. Oh. You have a lot of health, sir. Very good for me, draining up my archery skill. My marksman skill here is it's gonna, it's gonna get maxed out eventually. Not off of this pincushion, though. Let me back up. I hate you, game. I have been greatly inconvenienced by his lack of aim. Honestly, that could have been terrible. That could have been really, really bad. But for some reason, he couldn't aim any farther down. So uh, it worked out really well. An inconvenient game glitch for him, a life-saving thing for me. Whoop, thanks for coming down. I was just waiting there patiently. Oh, hey, him! I was gonna include a cut in if I didn't if I didn't see him in this part. This guy is extremely good at taking shots right to the face. You. I'm Ingvar the Wanderer, although most people now call me Ingvar Doomsayer. It's true, the world is about to be destroyed. Some people are frightened by this, or they despair, or even try to deny the truth of what I say. But my message is actually one of comfort. The world is ending, and we can't do anything about it. Once you accept that, you'll be at peace, like me. Okay, rumors? I hear that Eril is fed up with Brythar's antics. He really wants something done about it. What? Let's, let's not talk about that yet. Goodbye. All right. We see the town on the compass. We're almost there. Anyone here want me dead? You're new here, so I'll try to be patient with you. I am compiling a taxonomy of every living thing in the Shivering Isles. The weather, changes in the moon and stars, and their interrelationships. I must not be interrupted. My work requires the highest degree of concentration. I hope I won't have to repeat myself. Sure, whatever. 
I can see that the scope of my research is far beyond the limited understanding of a Cretan such as yourself. Let me make it very simple for you. Don't speak to me, ever. Now, thanks to your rude interruption, I have to start my day's work all over again. Well, I'm very sorry about that. Uh, that's going to take you forever. Hey there, sweeping the dirt. Your lips to his ears. Rumors? There's a man in bliss who believes his own house will collapse around him. Mer Merrily's research? Merrily? She is obsessed with collecting plants and animals. I'd steer clear of her. Now, do you mind moving? I need to sweep there. Take care. Can I... Can I speak to you? Ah, a stranger in town. But as I always say, a stranger is just a friend I haven't met yet. Hey, friend, do you think you could help me out? I'm caught a bit short at the moment. Anything at all would be much appreciated. <laughs> Get lost. Oh, I remember this. Have a coin. Thanks. Thanks a lot. Rumors. If you want to sneak up on one of those zealots, wear one of their robes. Fools them every time. That's actually true. Merle's research? She doesn't like it when I run through her plants. All she seems to care about is collecting plants and animals. Hmm. Bye. Hey, got any apples or carrots? Anything at all crunchy and yummy to eat? Sorry, I can't help you right now. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no, 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 no. Hey, got any? Sorry, I can't help you right now. Oh no! Oh no! 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 Oh no! 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 My feet hurt so bad. I could sure use a new pair of shoes. Can you help me out, please? What? What did you say? What did you say? Me 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 me. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh my god, that cracked me up so much as a kid. You think you can spare a little something? Have a coin. Thanks. Thanks a lot. I don't mind giving the money. I don't have shoes though for her. Um. Where did she go? It's amazing to me, runs in circles can have a house. She seems like the type to wear a hole in the floor. Um. Interesting. So where did she go? No, sincerely though, where did she go? I should turn on Detect Life. Greetings. Oh, she's right up here. Can't you see I was in the middle of my daily dewfall survey? Now I have to start all over again. Rumors. There's a Khajiit in Crucible who believes the world is about to end. There's a man wandering the wilds that believes the world is about to end. Mirelli's research. My work is far too important to trust to you. You need say her disposition. What you're going oh, to say. You need her disposition above sixty. And uh, we are insult to her at the start. Put that really low, which is why I did it, because otherwise you won't get other dialogue. But the dialogue is relatively the same otherwise. Start. Please. Ugh. That's for me. Thanks. 
All right, the disposition is maxed out at 90. That's not bad. Merely's research. You're offering to help me with my research? Well, I suppose I could find a use for you, despite your lack of training. Here's the list of things I need. Get me everything on it. Try to remember where you found it so you can tell me. It's important. Okay. Wh what else can you tell me? Do you have any new items from the list? I have some interesting specimens. I haven't found any. No luck, huh? Well, I have to get back to my research. Really, research? Do you have any new items from the list? I actually... no. No luck, huh? Do you... No luck. Do you... No luck. For you, of course. Do you have any... I have some interesting specimens. Excellent. I'll just take them. These are perfect for my research. Thank you. Now go. Shoot. Now, uh, what else is on that list of hers? Alocasia fruit, aster bloom, black tar, blister pod, congealed putrescence, digestive slime, elytra icor, flame stalk, fungus stalk, gas bladder, gnarl bark, grumad eggs, hound tooth, hunger tongue. Uh, we gave her the only one. Hydnum, azure, giant spore, pod pit, rot scale, scale on fin, screaming maw, shambles marrow. Well, that's a pretty rare one. Uh, swamp tentacle, thorn hook, void essence, watcher's eye, withering moon, worm's head cap. I, Marilla Yovan of High Cross, will pay for the samples of the following items, the sum of ten coins each. As I only need one sample of each, I shall not pay for duplicates. It's nice that she mentions that. Yeah, you don't get duplicates off of her. However, we have gotten already a substantial amount of the list off. So, I'm going to save here. And... I'm going to look up the rest of the list. In order to appropriately complete this quest, we actually need to explore several caves. Some of which are on, in, on Mania's side, and some of which are on Dementia's side. We're going to head over to Dementia first, because we have one of their caves already discovered. Haha, we successfully harvested Wisp Core. Is that the correct thing? Finally, I think that's every ingredient. I've actually been uh, recording this episode for an hour and a half. You guys are only getting like 30 minutes of this. Be grateful to me and my indefinite warmth. Eh, that's not true, but it did take a while. Uh, there's actually one that I don't think I have and I think I can get it from here. Yeah, I can. There we go. Merry Christmas. No, not that house. Is this the house? Uh... Oh, hey, get back here. I hate these interruptions, but I suppose they're unavoidable. Your research? Remind me to ask you about my bestiary. In the meantime, what have you found for me? No luck. Remind me to ask... I have some interesting specimens for you. Excellent. I'll just take them. These are perfect for my research. Thank you. Now go. Shoot. Ah. I've heard since... <sighs> 
I really must thank you. Chapters 23 and 48 of my taxonomy are now complete thanks to your effort. Please, take this as a token of my gratitude. Your research. Remind me to ask you about my excellent. These are per. I hate these inter. Okay. My bestiary. Oh yes, I want to start one. I'd like a ballyward to begin with. You just get it close to me, and I'll take care of subduing it. I might accidentally kill it. If that happens, just bring me another. Once I have it, I'll make sure it's worth your while. I have some spells I can sell you if you have no way to command the beast yourself. Huh? By spell? Would you like one of these? Oh. Um, I'll take your princess command. This spell might do for a ballywog or an elytra hatchling. Don't try it on anything tougher, though. When you bring them to me, I intend to wait until the spell wears off to capture them. I enjoy the challenge. By spell? Would you like... Journeyman? I might as well have given it to you at that price, but it's worth it for my bestiary. When you bring them to me, I intend to wait until the spell wears off to capture them. Huh. Would you like... Expert. Bargain at twice the price. When you bring them to me, I intend to wait until the spell wears off to capture them. I enjoy the challenge. By spell? Hmm. Unfortunately, your pathetic illusion skill makes that idea useless. Hmm. Certainly. Wait, what's my illusion skill at? Watch for the Elytra Stingers. They're poison... Oh, whatever. What is my illusion skill at for her to say that? It's at 100? She only sells three levels of spell. I don't remember what kind of spell it is. Is it a touch spell or not? Let me find out. Okay. Apprentice, command creature up to level 5 for 30 seconds on touch. Journeyman, command creature up to level 12 for 30 seconds on touch. And Expert, command creature up to level 30, up to level 20 for 30 seconds on touch. But I actually already planned out ahead and I have my own. Maximum command creature, which is much more useful than, um, actually it's much more useful than what we have in our four See spot right now. Now, in order to get a Bollywog, you have to find one at random. That's the first time Oblivion has crashed in a while. Now, in order to get a Bollywog, you must just find one at random, really. They are often found along the shores, as you probably noticed if you played the game before. Sometimes you'll find them just on a pathway, and you'll probably be like, why am I encountering this? It's so weak, and that's because it's for this quest. And other times you'll, you'll, just, you'll just be near water. That's about it. Now, she gives you these in order. I actually uh, maximum command humanoid. Let me put that on, too. Let me put that on seven, actually. Four and seven. <clears throat> yeah, so, uh, there's a reason I wanted to do this quest and just get it out of the way. It's because of this. It's, it takes a while. Ha! Oh! Hey there, buddy. Now, 
No, no. I have two of you. Come on, friends. Oh, I can only have one. Well, I'll take the less damaged one. Now to get you back to that lady. I hate these interruptions, but I suppose they're unavoidable. Your research. Remind me to. Liar! You have nothing new here. Be gone until. But, Bollywog. I brought you a Bollywog. Wait for the spell to wear off. No, no, don't come any closer. I have to finish my morning survey at the default of four precise location. Hey, 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 hey. Why aren't you hostile? Oh, good. You've caught me a Balawag. I can't wait to study it. Let's go inside and I'll pay you. All right. Interesting. We're going to see the inside of her house. What happened? Why are they dead? We're gonna pretend they're not dead. Well, this is a wonderful start for my new bestiary. Well worth the price. Here you go. Oh, God. Hmm. I suppose it is about time for me to add another creature. I have hopes for an elytra. If you see one, could you bring it around for me? Okay. I hate these interrupt. Why? Bye. Hey, you have... You had some of these in here before. You sent me to get things you already had. What is up with today? Why is it so fuck? Ooh! Alright, come on, buddy. Oh, thank goodness. I had... I hate these... You're offering... Here's the little... Whatever, you bro you're broken there, but that's fine. I'm glad so I had to break the game a little. Me for my work long enough. And, uh, yeah, I did a few... Oh, right, the Elytra killed them. It's a really strong Elytra. So, uh, I'm gonna get out. My healing spell. My, uh, where is it? Where is my healing spell? Yes, 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 yes. It's about to wear off. Try not to kill it. An elytra. They're tricky. I'll make sure to magically bind this one to me. Let's go to the house to get your reward. Do a little dance. Did, 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 do a little dance. I'm just gonna walk away while it's still doing that. Well, do you want your pay or not? 
I want my pay and I want you to never do that again. You freaked me out, lady. I'm very excited to have an elytra. Here's your pay. I'm getting weary of the same two beasts. All they do is scream when I experiment on them. Do you suppose you could get me a nod? In Crucible, a man named Hiris Clotumnus has been trying to convince people to kill him. I hate these. Ma'am, I don't care. Bye. Not anymore. Ah, so the Elytra is over here now. Is it dead? Did the Elytra die? It died for no reason. Okay. So that one gnarl we saw before. Let's go get it. This is a very convenient episode so far, actually. And I know where I can find some scale on. They're just over the mountain over there. That's incredibly convenient. Well, convenient episode. This is actually a two-parter for me. I had to wait two days before I could finish recording it. And the first recording was around two and a half, two to two hours in length. Two-ish hours in length. <clears throat> Absolutely wild how long I've been going. Thanks, pal. What is this? We stumbled across it before, but I didn't get anything from it. Alright. Suppose that works for now. You stay mind washed. Let's go. I don't have time to talk. My work cannot wait. Come on. I hate the. I'm getting weary of this. We got you, your gnarl. Ah, uh, now I gotta wait till these guys get out of here. I don't have time to talk. My work cannot wait. You know what? No, no, I shouldn't. Oh, it muted her. Try not to kill it. Try not to kill it. You have to get me a new one if it dies. Try not to kill it. You have to get me Trying a new to keep one you dies. alive. You have to get me a new one if it dies. Paralyze it. Paralyze it. No, you've earned your reward. Follow me. Don't feel like I have. Here you go, bounty hunter. I can't wait to begin playing with my living tree. I hate these interrupts. And your bestiary's final entry. Yes, yes, I know. They're all looking quite tiresome. A scalon would sure spruce things up a bit, don't you think? She's not kidding. Bye. Oh boy. Where'd the gnarl go? Oh, wait, the elytra's over here. 
What's that, Elytra? But either way, look at it. It's cute. I like her gnarl. Alright. So you remember where we got the Bollywog? Same place. Actually, wait. There's probably one down here. There it is. Look at it. Aha! Man, that cuts this travel time down by a lot. Hey, you. That's fine. Go invisible. Hit me. Aren't you just the coolest looking thing? Oh, I should have been using command creature a lot earlier in the playthrough. Would that work on ghosts? I don't know. It actually might not, but it's worth a shot. You walk really, really, really slow. I'm just gonna let this spell wear off and have you chase me for a while instead. Fight! I don't have time to talk. My work cannot wait. Christ, it breathes like me in middle school. a bit mangy, but I suppose it will do. Your reward is in the house. What do you mean, mangy? It's literally the strongest one you can get. Well, you have proven to be quite the hunter. Take your bounty. You've earned it. My collection is complete. Thankfully, you won't be interrupting me anymore. Speak, madman. Tell me. And her more. disposition gets maxed out from the quest, and you just get a huge amount of gold. It's a pretty alright quest to take on early on, and I'm just not gonna hide it. I'm gonna resurrect these guys. They had such a short life, it was unfortunate. Hello. What do you need, friend? Anything for you. Try not to fight a grumite in the Blessings of the Mad God. There's smiths in New Sheoth that collect amber and madness ore. Very nice, very Take nice. Take care. So the Elytra and the Gnarl are there, and the Scalon and the Bollywog are over here. That looks really cool. Overall, I'd rate this quest as probably a 3 out of 10. It's not worth it, and it's incredibly monotonous. It can be very simple if you come here late in the game, but that's just not how that works. Anyways, in the next episode, we will be exploring a bit, like I mentioned before. That'll happen every once in a while. And we'll go back and explore the areas that you guys only saw some clips of, such as... Yeah, we didn't go in Dunraburo, actually. Didn't go to Fane, either. Uh, Zavara, Naughty Bramble, Blood Island Camp, who? So, we will be going back to places like Blackroot, Naughty Bramble, and Swamp Gas Hole. Though not inherently all in the same episode, I like to keep each dungeon, you know, secluded to itself. It'll be nice. Though, I think... 
one or two of those are quest related, and if they are, we won't be revisiting them next time. Instead, I'll substitute it for something else like Fane or this. I don't know what this one is, but uh, now I am digressing a bunch. Thank you guys, and I'm gonna get to a nice high spot to view the world. Hey, 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 hey. Oh my god, this is actually a really nice view. I don't know if I can see the camp out there, but you know, that's fine. I don't need to. Thank you guys. I will see you next time. Bye.